right and mind and be reminded of that covenant that he brought forth in his blood on the cross of Calvary before seven in the old covenant. Now we have the water letter but the spirit living in us. Come on, lift up all the things and hide
just as he healed, as he healed the nation of Israel. Yeah. So he's looking forward for that time when we'll go down there and bring this nation before Yahweh in the name of Yahweh and Yeshua. Hallelujah. And somebody. Hallelujah. So that is, is something that we must do. And I want you to join us. The time has been set for Sabbath. I see hands. The time has been set for Sabbath at 3 p.m. Now, I know Sister Beryl, Mr. Beryl has uh, been getting you guys together to prepare a social. I know we're working on that. And we're going to end it on Goodman's Bay around beginning at 6.30, 7 o'clock. We want to be in our seat. We're going to have a good time there. And we're going to close out this feast down there. But I want you, what, what me and Apostles agreed, is that we would come here and we're going to leave here no later than 2 o'clock. Now, if you all have a problem at 2 or you all think 3 is too late for those who are going to work, let us know. I haven't set the, the date for, for an appointment with the press release so we can bring it up to 2 and call straight to come on 1 or leave it at 3 and, and call straight to come on 2 so that we can all, if you want to, you know, it's not, a, it's not mandatory. We're going to invite you to come. We are hoping that you'll come and support this great move and be a part of history. All right? If you want to come down with us, you come down here. But it'll be done when it's two or three. Yeah. Nobody can stop this. this Hallelujah. 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 And those who are supposed to be there will be there. Bless Yahweh. So I thank Yahweh for that. So we want your support in coming forward. Any questions concerning that? Uh, what, I, what I wanted to say to you is want us to be in prayer, and however Father Yahweh leads you, we are also uh, looking into having um, 1540, uh, I have somebody looking into uh, two hours, so more or less 10 to 15 minutes, meaning to say the two o'clock, I mean it depends on what time you decide to get up, but I think they'll be able to give it to us as a they were trying to work it out a very, very good way. And so I'm looking for you and Apostle to uh, hopefully by tomorrow I'll have an answer be on radio. So we'll talk we'll talk about that. What, yeah, what, what I, I want, want to, to do. I want them, uh, what I want the congregation to do is the mention of it is to pray. Because I think what you are doing is to go to the nation as a whole. Me 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 and Apostle have spoken for that. I don't think we could be have the time to go to that detail this time around. But I will be on the radio uh, looking at um, Payne Thompson that goes all over the Bahamas, 104.5. And of course, you, you're working with me with Cody. But it's just to make a declaration and the atmosphere over this nation. Because more than any time now, you would be this nation is hurting. The government don't have the answer for the South this country. And, and let me tell you, it's no better time for us to decree and to declare that this nation come to Yahweh at this particular time. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And pray and pray and fasting in the right set time of Yahweh. Yes. It's a set time. Yes. It's a set time. He come down. He warned us. That's why we became a nation on the 10th of December month. Go ahead. Yes. I just want to ask a question because you mentioned it concerning the 10th of the seven months. Uh, some persons may be confused concerning when the scripture said on the tenth day of the seventh month. And we find out now six of tabernacles begin on what this month? On the fifth April. Mm -hmm. Okay? So I'd like you to really explain them what the word means when it said on the tenth day of the first month and why it fluctuates. Uh, the tenth of the seventh month. The tenth of the seventh month. Seven. Yes, the seventh month. Mm -hmm. yeah. Don't see that has to do with the different calendars. Mm -hmm. You see? Ten day of the seven month, as you know, is, is equivalent to September, October. That's why we're here. All right. And so we won't have time to explain all that in the press release. But trust me, I will help me to present in a way where we will focus on actually what happened, specifically, specifically the uh, feast of not the Yom, Yom Kippur, which is the, the time of fasting and praying. We will just focus on that area and why that is so. And why the Bahamas became a nation on the 10th day of the seventh month. You have time to get No, I'm not talking, I don't want to hear. You may be oh, wondering, okay. you hear the word say that also on the 10th day 
of the seven and there should be concerned in this atonement. And when we may look at it to be date uh, uh, 10, I said one, zero, on that 10th day, at that first month. But what it has to do, it has to do with new moon. The moon. This is a new moon, uh, and, and it deals with the lunar calendar, like you said so. And we know that we talk about new moon festival. It's when that new moon begins in that month. Mm -hmm. That is the 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 the, 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 the day feast the of tabernacles yeah. begin. begin. So ten days. He's talking about the tenth day or ten days after that new moon mm -hmm. should be what the day of atonement. The, the, yeah. the new moon is ready. The new month. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. That's what new moon right. means. Right. New month. So ten days so after that. New moon. Right. Yeah. So the new moon means new month. Yeah. yeah. Right. Mean the ten August. Yeah. New moon just simply means new month. Yeah. yeah. All right. But on the Jewish calendar, the the tenth day of the seventh month, it is not at the end. See, no. the see first day of the seventh month is feast of trumpet. But that is still not the end of a Gregorian calendar month. All right? But when we say the 10th day of the seventh month, it is still 10 days from ever, whenever that, that new month, that new month is, is on the lunar calendar. All right? But um, it is technical, but we don't need to get all of that. Hallelujah. Um, so thank you very much. Um, any other questions?